Royal spoonbills, scientific name Platelia regia, have an unusual feeding strategy. They catch small fish, crustaceans, crabs, insects and frogs by walking slowly through water, sweeping their open, spoon-shaped bill in an arc. When the sensitive pads on the inside of the bill detect food, it snaps closed, trapping the prey, which is then tossed down the throat. When breeding, both sexes develop a crown of long white plumes, striking yellow eyebrows and red forehead patches. These elegant birds are found across most of Australia, as well as in New Zealand, New Caledonia and East Timor, and parts of Indonesia and Papua New Guinea. Surprisingly, for such a strikingly beautiful and widespread species, the royal spoonbill wasn't even noticed by science until 1838, when the celebrated English ornithologist John Gould wrote the scientific description and gave the species the scientific and common names it still holds. The illustration of the royal spoonbill was done by Gould's wife, Elizabeth. Worldwide, there are six species of spoonbill, only one of which is regarded as endangered. This is the royal spoonbill's closest relative, the East Asian black-faced spoonbill, which currently breeds only on a few small islands off the west coast of North Korea. In Australia and New Zealand, the only bird the royal spoonbill could be confused with is the yellow-billed spoonbill but this is easily distinguished by its yellow bill and off-white plumage. Royal spoonbills forage in shallow, fresh, salt or brackish water and they're quite at home in urban areas if these habitats are present. The nest is an open platform of sticks in a tree. The female lays two or three eggs and the chicks hatch after 21 days. When breeding, royal spoonbills are highly sensitive to disturbance. Whole colonies have been known to desert their eggs after a minor upset. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that red subscribe button and then the bell icon and you'll be notified of new Werong Lane videos.